This engineered river channel east of Los Angeles was the site of one of the last battles of the Mexican-American War in California, the Battle of Rio San Gabriel. United States and California forces fought over this stretch of river on the afternoon of January 8, 1847. Seizing California from Mexico and adding it to the American empire was one of the main reasons that U.S. President James K. Polk took his country to war with Mexico in April 1846. In June of that year, Anglo-American colonists revolted in Sonoma and declared the independent California Republic. The following month, Commodore Sloat of the U.S. Navy landed in Monterey and demanded the surrender of California. Mexican resistance quickly collapsed in California after the arrival of U.S. forces, with Los Angeles falling to the invaders in mid-August. The Mexican governor, Pio Pico, and General Jose Castro fled California as the Americans overran the territory. But the Americans' victory was short-lived. Soon after Pico and Castro left the state, California soldiers and civilians staged a grassroots rebellion and drove the American invaders out of San Diego, Los Angeles, and the other towns of Southern California. American forces moved to reconquer Southern California. Forces led by Commodore Robert F. Stockton retook San Diego in October 1846. A smaller force under the command of Stephen W. Kearney, which had marched overland from New Mexico, joined Stockton's forces, and together they marched north to take Los Angeles a second time. The Americans met the Californios here at the upper ford of the San Gabriel River. California commander Jose Maria Flores placed his forces here on the bluff overlooking the river. He had his artillery in the center and the cavalry on the flanks. The artillery turned out not to be very effective and it failed to prevent the Americans from crossing the river. This was partly due to the fact that the Californios were using poor quality powder. Once the Americans had made it across the river, Flores's cavalry made several charges against them, but the Americans deflected them each time with gunfire. The cavalry retreated, and the Americans had won the battle, sort of. The next day, the Californios attacked the Americans in a running engagement on the march toward Los Angeles, called the Battle of the Mesa. But the Californios were once again unable to stop the American advance. Los Angeles surrendered for a second time the next day. And on January 13, the Californios signed the Treaty of Cahuenga, which brought the conquest of California to an end.